Hi everyone. So, uh, so I'm going to talk about some uh, uh, work that we, I recently did with uh, Klaus and Rami from UCSD and other uh, unknown. <laughs> um, so uh, this work is about Blade. Uh, Blade is a static detector of spectral-like vulnerabilities, the kind of vulnerabilities that we heard today in uh, the other Marcus talk. Um, we, our static detection is based on a transient flow type system and uh, what B Blade additionally offers is automatic repair of vulnerable program with the uh, extra, uh, um, with the, uh, you can repair uh, programs uh, with a minimal number of fences. So just let me give you a brief overview of how uh, our type system works. Um, uh, array laws in our type system represent sources of transient values. At runtime, you might read outside the boundaries of the array, and uh, this might uh, uh, read the secret data. And so our type system marks this as transient type, and uh, it uh, propagates uh, transient types uh, throughout the program, and uh, uh, it looks carefully at things, and our type system prevents, rejects program where transient expression with the transient types uh, flow to a sink. <clears throat> uh, we can repair this program. We can repair, always repair spectre, uh, vulner uh, programs vulnerable to spectre by inserting uh, fences. In our uh, work, uh, we look at a general API, a protect that can turn transient uh, uh, data into stable data. So this is one way to fix the program. Uh, this is a, a suboptimal patch because it requires to use two um, protects. So after protect, X and Y are so-called stable, they're not transient anymore. Uh, this is a better uh, patch because we only use one protect. And we do this, uh, our algorithm uh, basically uh, computes the minimal number of patch of uh, um, fences by uh, cutting the data flow between sources and sinks. In very briefly, we uh, take a program, we convert it in a def, into a diffuse graph, and uh, uh, this is a transient, uh, this is a sink, and this is the, sorry, that's the source, and that's the sink. If we have a path from the uh, source to the sink, uh, we have a problem, we have a vulnerability, and uh, we apply a, a well-known max flow mean cut algorithm to compute the optimal cut. Um, there's more things that I would like to talk about. I will just give you a, a high level of review. We uh, uh, developed a, a speculative and out of order operational uh, semantics for uh, this language and we use it to design uh, a, a fine-grained primitive called PROTECT. We prove soundness of our approach, that's the speculative <coughs> interference property that uh, the other Marco also talked about today. And uh, we evaluated the uh, blade on uh, uh, Echolstar, this is a verified crypto library. And uh, uh, we uh, also uh, saw that if we use speculative load hardening, uh, it's another way to um, block uh, speculations, we actually take uh, almost twice as many uh, fences in our fine-grained fence. So we would really like to have something like protect uh, in uh, available it, uh, as a uh, hardware instruction. So that's all for me. Thank you.